Hey Emily, Coach Brandon here. So just like we talked about, you can kind of see when your foot gets down right there, what your back elbow is doing. You're starting to bring it towards the ball. Again, this is just going to create control issues. And as you can tell, the ball is coming this way and your barrel is moving down underneath of it. And, and that causes a lot of pop flies. If you could get the barrel behind the ball and move through it this way, the ball is going to go, and it's, you can see your barrel is moving down here, the ball is going to be more on this angle out into the outfield instead of up like this. And this is what we want out here. We want... And one indication of this is where your hands, where your arms look like as your wrist is rolling over right here and your barrel is there. So if you extend down into the ground here this way, a lot of your balls are going to go up or you're going to hit on top of the ball and it's going to go into the ground as well. And the main reason that you're losing control there is all because you move the back elbow to the ball instead of keeping it behind your hands and turning your body. That's going to take the barrel right into this zone and be create a much more level swing and it's going to allow you to hit the ball a lot farther. So take a look at this and then watch yourself in the mirror and I'm going to show you guys some drills to um, combat this epidemic of back elbow drag that we're seeing.